Hello, everybody. Welcome to another edition of the PSD to CSS online video tutorial series. My name is Sean. Today, we're going to look at a new feature. Uh, it's the first of a set of Facebook features. Um, we're going to add another a bunch of features that you can use to uh, to integrate your website that you build with PSD to CSS online to integrate your website with Facebook using Facebook Connect. Um, today, we're going to show how you can share your website or your web page. Uh, on your Facebook feed uh, very, very easily. You can allow your users, more importantly, you can al allow your users, the people who visit your website, to share your website on their feeds um, very, very easily. Uh, of course, Facebook gives you this option, you, but uh, somebody has to cut and paste your URL and they have to paste it into their Facebook feed. And, and uh, this, this is a much simpler way. This is a way you get to design the button. You put it in your own website, uh, make it look like anything you want, your user will click on that button and it will instantly fa uh, uh, share your website in their feed. So uh, let's see how we do that. First we'll start with a, uh, a very simple uh, design as for anything else with PSD to CSS Online. You start with a Photoshop design of your web page. You just draw your web page. Uh, you've got a number of layers over here for your that you build with Photoshop, just like any Photoshop drawing. Um, and then if you name some of the layers correctly, you'll get special things to happen uh, in, your, in the website that's built by PSD to CSS Online. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, uh, so this is a pretty straightforward one. It's just got this kind of big white area background here that's called stripe uh, underscore center. We'll make sure it's centered in the page and it's going to be a JPEG image. Um, but the, uh, the new feature is FB share. So you can see here we've got uh, uh, share underscore FB share underscore link. So that's this button down over here. You can see it. Um, we also have a link over, share underscore FB share underscore link over. Uh, uh, if you've used PSD to CSS Online before, you know these the, the share in the beginning will make these things work together so that this just becomes a button um, a mouse mouse over. And, uh, and you'll see how that works in a second. Uh, but we've got a text area here and, uh, um, and a logo. It's a very simple website and a repeating background image. Um, it's a very simple website, uh, but what you do is uh, we save it, save our Photoshop file, and then all you do is visit PSD to CSS Online, and you upload that des design. You want to log in first. Um, you upload this design, and PSD to CSS Online takes a little while to think about it, and uh, it'll take apart that Photoshop file, it'll take apart all those layers, it'll generate all the HTML, it'll generate CSS uh, divs out of all the layers, it'll process all the images in the layers, um, but most importantly it's going to write some special JavaScript uh, for this, in this case, for this FB code here, we're already done. Uh, it's going to write some special JavaScript for that button to share on Facebook, uh, so you don't have to know how to write that code, you don't need to know about uh, Facebook Connect JavaScript libraries. Um, I'm using uh, a library called Moo Connect. You don't need to know anything about that. So here's here's the web page. As you can see, it was it's completely generated. It looks just like it did in our Photoshop design. It even has some text in it. And here is our uh, mouse over button. Share this on Facebook. And sure enough, when you click on it, it takes you straight to the Facebook uh, share um, dialog, which uh, gives you uh, an option to uh, choose which image out of the out of the page you'd like to use as a thumbnail. Um, puts the title and uh, some des description information, and uh, I would just have to hit share here, and uh, it'll post this. Oh, I'm, yeah, that's right. I got to do captcha. Um, D R O L L E S T was successfully posted to my my uh, f my Facebook page. So here is my Facebook page. I'll reload it here, and sure enough, there you see right at the top. I already did it earlier this morning. Uh, you, there's right at the top is uh, the page I just shared on Facebook, and I didn't have to visit Facebook first and cut and paste the URL and make a new. Po you know, I didn't have to do any of that. As a visitor to this website, all I had to do was press this button. So uh, that's the first of our uh, Facebook uh, features. Uh, we'll be adding uh, Connect, and uh, well, we'll be adding all sorts of stuff about Facebook into uh, into PSD to CSS Online, so that you can build Facebook enabled Facebook Facebook engaged websites quickly and easily without having to write any code at all. Thanks.